Hi. I'm not one of those techno freaks. You know, I don't have flashing lights or or uh, images or uh, and bells ringing to say promote me and that. No, I'm just here to give you some good advice. I, I've been into computers since they were first come out in the 1980s. I've always loved computers. And I've always been good at problem solving. I was once in a firm where I was work. I worked in the word processing, and uh, if they had software problems, I was there to solve them. And often I learned on the job. I got problems and I sort sort them out. So I'm very good at that. And I'm what this is why I'm on here now, not to promote anything, not to ask for you to subscribe or anything, but just to give you a good tip. Now, what happened was, believe it or not, although I'm going on 76, I love to play shoot 'em up games. And one of my favourites is uh, Sniper Elite. Uh, I've, got, I've got the first one, I've got the second one, and I've got the third one. Can't get any more because they put them on uh, Xbox and whatever. And I'm not into that. I just play on the PC, so I'm stuck with that. I wish I wish they would put them on PC because I would have gone further. But no, so I'm talking about now playing Sniper Elite. Well, I was playing version two. I love the challenges on that. I'm getting very good high scores on that. I'm good at that. Keeps my brain, you know. I'm getting old now. I've got you got to think of that. You got to dodge around and work it out. So it's good, it's good for me. Anyway, that, that's besides the bye. Let's talk about the problem. Now, I was playing, I was playing the game with Steam. This is what this is all about. I was playing it for a long time, many years, and then suddenly I got a, a Windows update. And you know, I hate Windows updates. They often mess up my computer, and I don't know what they're doing when they update. I don't know what they're putting on there because nothing changes except they mess it up. Most of the time, it messes up. Anyway, so when I got a Windows update, I went to go into Steam to play Sniper Elite version two, and it said not connected to the internet. Blah blah blah. You know the screen, you've, this is why you're probably watching this, because you've had that, and you've got that. And I, and I tried for many times to, to see what would happen, and uh, it just wasn't working for me. So I went on YouTube to find out if I could, because YouTube's pretty good, They're helping me problems out. So I went on YouTube to see what I can help, so I, I did a search, um, Steam, no internet connection. And I got all these funny things saying, you've got to go in here, you've got to type this and that, you've got to type this and that, and you've got to do this, and you're keying in this and put PT, oh God. and then even going into the MS DOS and keying in this and then typing that, I thought, God no, this is too much. And I, and I thought, I'm going to find an easier way. And I did. Without any diagrams, or putting up flashy screens, because it's so simple, I'll tell you what you've got to do. Go into your windows, go to the control panel, and uninstall the program. Uninstall Steam. Get rid of it. Uninstall the lot, and then shut your computer down, shut it down, and then start it up again. Now, go on the website and go to Steam. Go to their webpage and download it. Download the Steam app. Doesn't take long, download it and install it. And that's it. 
once you've got it installed, click on click on your game or Steam, and it loads up. And you don't get a question, oh no internet, it loads up. And you can continue playing. This is what I did, I'm now back on playing version 2 challenge sniper elite I, 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 when, when it when it first fell me i thought oh my god what am i going to do with my spare time now i can't go on the game i can't go and play me get, shoot i can't kill germans anymore oh dear but, but this is what i did believe me it's worked it works so forget all those gizmos on youtube who tell you Key in this and add this into your um, uh, what did it say? Um, administrator, click, click and, and write this and key in this. Forget all that. Just do as I said. It's simple. Un uninstall the Steam app you have, and then go to Steam and download a new Steam from from the website. And I find this is the same problem I had with the. Uh, I bought a. Uh, an Epson printer. When I tried to install it, it just said, oh, not in the internet, not on the internet, not on the internet. And I was about to send it back. But what I did then, I understood what I had, what I put on from the disk, and I went to the Epson website and downloaded the software from there. And it's worked just fine. So most of the time, it's a bit like when, you know when they say, the summer's not working, switch it off, pull out the plug, but it's the same thing. If the apps you get mostly come on software that you buy, and they're probably out of date. There's probably something wrong with it. And, and maybe Windows mess it up, whatever, because they keep updating stuff, and you, know, you don't know what they're doing. But just forget that. Un uninstall the app, go to their website, whatever it is, whether it's Steam or whether it's Epson or whatever it is, and download their latest app. That's my solution to you, and I hope this works for you. It worked for me. If it, if it doesn't work for you, then I'm sorry. You'll have to go back to uh, the gizmos and key in this and key in this and then... Uh, oh. Anyway, hope this works for you. Thanks for listening. Bye for now. I, if, I, if I get any more simple problems, I'll get back to you, because I'm, I'm very good at this. I'll get back to you. Bye for now. Bye.